hi every baby welcome back and welcome to my channel if you're new i'm a princess and i'm an age aggressor and i'm autistic and trans and guess what we are going to discuss abdl little space on a budget here we go okay that's my baby mobile music playing that i play for um, stuff to make the channel and me calm because I'm autistic, so it helps us calm down. So, yes, and I don't have to worry about it because it's free and it's a baby Mozart, baby Einstein. You get it from Walmart, they have them in the baby section. Check them out, real baby section. So, if you're starting out new as an adult baby, or if you're autistic, or if you're into age aggression, little space community, all the above. You can start getting cheaper, let's just say this, let me recommend first Bambino diapers or rearsdiapers.com or tykables.com or my favorite place to shop, littlekinkboutique.com. If you could afford it and you're over 18, shop there. If you're not 18, don't watch my channel, please and thank you, and you have to wait till you're 18. That's all. Sorry. So, back to the conversation. Those diapers are meant for the adult body with a baby print. They hold 400 to 600 milliliters of water, which I call Piddle Piddle, which is number one, or P. So I recommend them if you can afford it. And I know ABDL and age regression lifestyle is very expensive because it is a lot to endorse all this babyism and childlike wonder and fun but it's expensive. But I recommend getting an adult good brand if you're going to actually use them to pee in. The cheaper brand, Walmart, Target, CVS, you can go to the adult section and medical section department where the diapers are, and you can get them. You can. Um, you guys probably see me a lot in a t-shirt, but like, I'm a baby poor girl on a budget. I'm not going to keep swapping onesies and jammies. I have my other one here, too. Um, you can get this. Uh, I did a video on it. Check it out. Littlecomforts.com. And I got my onesie. I do wear it. That's why it's on my crib rails here. <laughs> so, but um, you can start out with going to those places I just mentioned and get diapers. But I'm not going to lie. Yeah, you get more diapers for your money, but they don't hold the adult capacity of piddling in them. That's why I recommended what I said before, it's better. So that's if you could afford it. But toys, we're gonna talk about toys, the best part of the whole thing. And any kind of autism sensory issues. Go to your local thrift shops, recycled shops, donation shops, savers, if you're in Utah or the West. Um, Walmart, the adult baby section. Well, not the adult baby section, but the real baby section. Super fun, sensory stuff that crinkle, Mirrors, they're awesome. They're kind of affordable. Um, yard sales. Check out any kind of yard sale, especially for Labor Day, the summertime. Yard sales are the best. People are always selling stuff for baby toys at yard sales. And they give it away for, like, dirt cheap because they want to get rid of it. And other people like to recycle them and use them. Check out thrift shops, donation shops. Check out your local churches that do donation shops, your local family shops, mom and pop shops. There's plenty of places to go, big lots, plenty of places to go to get toys. And you can always wipe them down with Lysol wipes. When it comes to stuffed animals, I recommend throwing them in the trash bag for like a week tight. Leave it on your porch outside if you have your own home. If you have an apartment, maybe the hallway or in a closet, but make sure you spray it down with the Lysol disinfectant spray. Not bleach, pure bleach. Use disinfectant Lysol spray. It says that there you get it at Walmart, Dollar General, Target, Family Dollar. It says disinfectant Lysol spray. You spray the whole stuffed animal down, you throw it in a garbage bag real tight, let me show the air is out of it, and you tie it, leave it there for like a week or two, and whatever was on it, God forbid, if there is on it, it'll be dead. So, then it's safe. Um, what else? Um, you have any friends who have children, they will be glad to give you some baby stuff if they're nice and kind and know you're into this lifestyle if you're open and honest like I am. Here you go. 
and they'll give it to you. You know, if their kids are growing up and maturing. Boring! <laughs> they'll give you their kids stuff too, or if you ask them, you know, hey, do you know anyone who has children's toys for like, for free or donation? Hey, Facebook Marketplace is another place to go to check out for uh, toys and uh, accessories for your baby space. Super fun. Um, what else you can do? Dollar Tree is another good spot to start out with. Um, you can get dinosaurs, coloring books, markers, crayons there. Um, I don't recommend getting the uh, passies there. Get yourself an adult Nook 5 Nook Passy, which you can get on Rears.com, Tykebulls.com, LittleForBig.com, LittleKinkBoutique.com, Launchbox.com. Um, I'm not good with this whole description thing. Um, I can try it, and I'll maybe see if I can do it in the video, so check the description. Or, if not, play the video again, and just listen carefully what I said, and I announced the websites. You can get them on, um, littlecomforts.com, littlecomforts.com, check them out. Another good spot to get, um, passy slash dummies, we call them dummies. So, and if you hear me say nappies, that means diapers. If you hear me say dummies, it means pacifier. I like to use a lot of British English slang words, like, I'm in my flat, which means home. So, yeah. Um, what else? Um, stuff for cheap. You can always get, like, um, wooden baby blocks, the plastic blocks, those are cheap and affordable. You get them at Walmart. Not really expensive. Um, I don't know. Those are all the things I kind of know that you can do. I got my little Winnie the Pooh rattle. I got this at a local thrift shop, I think for like $2. And I love it. Oh my god, it makes me so happy. Oh, I love Winnie the Pooh. <sighs> So my nursery is going to be Winnie the Pooh themed eventually. I'm trying to get bed sheets to match, and then I'm done. I mean, I'm not going to go like OD and go ham and everything Winnie the Pooh, but it's Winnie the Pooh themed slash baby farm animal themes and like little like magical fairy forest creatures. I don't know. Check out my playlist on my other channel if you like. I mentioned it plenty of times, so pick a video. I just, I'm just tired of repeating myself. <laughs> but I'm trying to get that channel back. I'm on a 90 day punishment. Because people want to lie and be transphobic and make false reports. So, yeah, um, this is my second channel, which will be my first channel. So, I'll just say it one more time. If you're subscribed to my main channel, which is called Little Playground of Dreams. Please subscribe to my second channel, which you're watching this already, which is called Emily Little Playground. Both channels are the same, same kind of content, just this one's more careful. And I'm not going to have a playlist on this one. And it's just only going to be autism, ABDL, age aggression, and little space. The other channel has more a variety of a playlist, so that's the big difference. They are actually different. This is strictly... Adult baby diaper lover content, autism, age aggression, little space, and all adventures having to do with that topics. 18 plus only, thank you. Um, I don't know what else to say. I'm just checking in, guys. Stay tuned, please. Hit the notification bell, subscribe to this channel. One more day, and I get to go live with you guys. And I'm going to have a huge live, and it's going to be fun. And very appropriate, and if you're inappropriate, you will be blocked and deleted because we are not tolerating that behavior on this channel. Um, this channel is going to be a lot more safer, better, and we are not tolerating bullying, transphobia, and inappropriate questions. And if that, you guys do that, you won't be allowed to talk to me on my live. So, stay tuned for that. I already posted it in my comments in my thingy, whatever it's called. So that's all I'm gonna say for now. I'm just checking in. I'm just living my best adult baby life. And also I'm gonna talk about this too. I have been depressed lately and I am very lost as a little. 
Not that I can't cope with myself, but I have to be a realistic baby. I don't have a lot of friends. You have to really sit down with yourself. I'm talking about myself, but if you can identify and resonate to this, great. Do a checklist. One through ten. Or one through twenty. Whatever's good for you. Do you have more associates in life? Or do you have more friends? Really think about those Cuomo's and like what they really mean. I don't have a lot of friends. Um, the people who do live near me don't walk and see me and don't call me. And it's not like they're far away. They're three to four block radius difference. Excuse me. Um, I find it. Um, but no. Um, I have an ex-daddy who I still talk to as friends. And he's a good person and he'll always be in my life. Just we're not dating. And that's okay. But I'm not looking forward and I'm not looking to date nobody else because we're still mentally ill and sick. And we have to take care of the diabetes and the health issues. And that's number one. A boyfriend, a daddy dom, or a mommy dom, or a caregiver, whatever you want to call it. It's not important right now. What's important is taking care of the baby girl, which is me, right here. So, I said what I said. I'm done talking. I don't know. I love you guys. Thanks for subscribing to this channel. Um, this channel was different when I first started. But I deleted a lot of videos. Some of the shorts I'm still going to keep up because... I still have my beliefs, and I'm not going to change it, but it is what it is, and I'm mostly, like I said, in the about part on my channel, you can read it, what this channel is mostly about, what I'm going to start doing, so yes, um, but if there's any other excess old videos, I'm just going to leave them up there, I don't care, so love yous, be brave, be yourself, dreams come true when you wish upon a star. And I just want to make another short little video, just, you know, talking about what you can get as an adult baby online that's expensive, and what you can get an adult baby that's cheap. And I hope this video helped you out, and I love you all, be brave, and I don't know what else I'm going to do. I mean, I got toys everywhere. I got a Barbie dream house over here, I got a Hello Honeybee Eaker's house over there, I just woke up from a nap, my pillow is soaked from drool. <laughs> so... Yeah. Mwah. Bye. If you like it, thumbs it up, please. It helps the algorithm out.